Hello and welcome back to Everything Gaming. I hope you all had a fantastic Christmas and that you and your family stayed safe. Now today you are joining me for the very last Forzathon of 2020 or technically the very first Forzathon of 2021 if you're watching this tomorrow. Now this Forzathon is a really really easy one, it's called Mini Adventure so we're going to get stuck in now and pick out a Mini to use. Now there is quite a few Minis to pick from, um, but the one I went for is the 1965 Mini Cooper S. Now everyone should have this or have access to it, it's a barn find. If you don't have one, you can always pick one up in the uh, auction house, or you can use another Mini of your choice, it's entirely down to yourself. I have also created a tune for it, it's called Mini Falls-a-thon, and the share code is 9315384855, and that's available for all of you guys to use, and I would recommend using a tune just to get the challenges over and done with quicker. Now the first one just wants you to win two road racing series events, which is super, super easy. So as you can see, I've just filtered the map here, and we're going to head over to the Lakehurst Forest Sprint. Now I'm sure you know what is coming next, um, of course I always create sort of really short races for various sort of forza uh, and this is one that i've had from before so the share code is 2086721282 and again that's there for you guys to use so it's a really quick road race event it shouldn't take more than 10 seconds depending on how how quick your car is um, and as soon as you win one of them all you have to do is win it again and that's the first challenge complete and you can do it on whatever difficulty you want as well it's entirely down to yourself now the next challenge here again is another simple one just like the previous one except it wants you to win three dirt series events. Now the dirt series event that I'm using is the Glen Rannock Trail. So again I've got a race created called Forzathon Easy. So the share code for that is 733-545-904 uh, and you guys are more than welcome to hop onto this one. Now just remember unlike the first challenge for this one you've just got to win three of them but again it's about 10 to 15 seconds per race so it probably takes longer to load the actual races than it takes to complete them um, but again super super easy and you can do it on whatever difficulty you want it doesn't really matter because the AI driver tires sort of go off on their own little adventure now the next and final challenge just wants you to earn nine stars in total from speed zones so again this is super super easy and i would recommend having a tuned mini for this but the speed zone that i used is forest green now to get three stars on here all you have to do is hit 90 mile an hour so that just means if you get three stars on three runs that's the challenge complete and again this won't take any more than five minutes in fact i'm literally showing you the clip now so it's about one and a half to two minutes to complete so again super super easy this is definitely the easiest speed zone in the game as well because it's such a low bar that's been set to get three stars that you can do it in almost any car even if you use a sort of higher level mini you don't really need to tune them um, but we just went all out on this old school 1965 mini cooper s um, but anyway guys i hope this did help you out if you are struggling with any of the challenges just say so down below in the comments and i'll try my best to help you out um, also, I would like to wish everyone a happy new year. I hope that 2021 brings you a lot of happiness and success. Um, and hopefully it's a bit better than 2020 has been. It's been a weird year, but, you know, we've made it through. Um, and we've had all these falls to keep us going, I guess. So but hopefully in 2021, we'll see, start seeing some new bits um, on the new Forza game, which is going to be a motorsport. So Horizon 5 probably won't be out until 2022. But not a big deal. You know, turn 10 and playground games. Keep on adding stuff into Horizon 4 so it's still a ton of fun. But like I said, if you have any questions or queries, just say so down below in the comments. Uh, apart from that, I want to say a massive thank you for all of the support you guys have given me throughout 2020 and since the start of my channel a few years ago. Um, I, I really do always appreciate it. And I will be doing a giveaway as promised. Um, you know to show my gratitude and my thanks to you guys but apart from that folks i want to wish you all the best may you have a happy new year take care and stay safe